Oh, hey there, guys. What's going on? As you guys know, I'm True Tris, just getting a, a, a nice bucket of milk um, for me to drink here. Um, but anyways, what's going on? I hope you guys are having a great day. I hope you guys uh, are having warm weather. I know it's kind of getting warm out, uh, depending on when you guys are watching this video. It's the springtime, and a lot of people are pretty happy um, that... Things are heating up in the world here, but anyways, today I got an awesome tutorial for you guys. I think a lot of you guys are really going to find this thing to be useful, and um, you guys can find a lot of different uses for this tutorial. Rather, I mean, if you guys do it your own way, or if you guys add a little bit to it, um, it's always interesting in uh, like seeing what you guys do with this stuff. But anyways, if you guys do enjoy my videos, make sure you guys do smack the like button. Really does mean a lot to me. Really shows your support to my channel, and uh, and you can also leave your PSN your Nintendo ID or your Xbox game tag down in the comment section too. But anyways, let's get with the tutorial here. It's actually very, very simple and I think a lot of you guys are really, really going to enjoy it. So what does this thing do? It's actually a staircase, a normal staircase. You can come up here, just walk it up. Yeah, whatever. Oh, I, I don't have anything on here. I was too lazy to continue the staircase. Um, but anyways, what you can actually do is you can hide things behind the staircase. If I just press this button here. The thing just comes up and oh it's a magical chest oh my gosh oh my gosh it's a magical magical chest back there but anyways um you can also keep it there if you guys really want to but for this tutorial i'm gonna be teaching you guys how you can make it um it's really really simple and uh, i think a lot of you guys are gonna find this thing to be really awesome but anyways first things first depending on what you guys plan on making it i, I just like using block and cords i think it looks really nice with the tu tutorials i should say so let's get ahead uh with the actual video so now what you actually want to do you want to dig um eight blocks across here you want to go one two three four five six seven eight and then you want to do the same exact thing again so one two three four five six seven eight and then do the same exact thing you just want to match up with the other side here there we have it and then you know you're going to be doing it right if you actually put down a, um, a sticky piston on one side you, you know what you actually want to do you want to make sure um, depending on wherever you guys plan on actually doing it where it doesn't really matter too much um, just always make sure that if you happen to put a sticky piston down and another sticky piston down right across from it just like so uh, you want to make sure when they actually get released and this one oops hang on I'm gonna re release this guy hang on oops I'll put them on top of this guy oops hang on there we go when, when they actually get released um, you want to actually want to have two block spaces so like for example this does not actually do it but if I actually move this uh, sticky piston over here and then now I can actually, when it, when he actually gets released, is actually going to have uh, two block spaces in between. If you guys want to do it your own way, maybe you guys want to have the staircase get pushed into like a wall or something like that. It's very very possible. Uh, but regardless, uh, that's pretty much what you need to do. So you can actually start putting down your stairs right there. But to do the nice redstone wiring, you want to get the redstone repeaters. Put them on both sides. Um, it doesn't really matter what it ticks you guys have, but I recommend if you guys do mess around with the ticks, if you guys want to have like a little delay, make sure that you guys actually, actually have um, them set for the same way so nothing gets confused there. Uh, then pretty much all you want to do is want to uh, return the redstone wire all the way across. Hang on. There we have it. All the way. And then you want to go on the other side too. Do the same exact thing here. Just like so. So now... You can kind of see where I'm getting at here, um, how you actually are going to be seeing these stairs get split up. So right away, actually, if I throw this thing down and I throw down a button, you guys will see that the staircase will actually split just like that. Um, I do recommend if you guys want maybe a little bit more delay, I'll, I'll throw some delays down on this side. So you can see how like, the, the, it's a little delayed on this side. I mean, you can kind of like network or wire whatever you guys want to have to do to make it maybe a little bit more quicker or whatever but anyways moving on um, I'm actually gonna retick these things to the regular default ones um, now you actually want to just build a staircase up so it's really quite simple uh, one major trick too is make sure you guys start your wiring with a block on top of your redstone torch just like so so once you have this then you can throw down some redstone on top of that and now you're pretty much all ready to go all you have to do now is throw down a block just like this and then whoops hang on i'm sorry you probably if you really want to make this thing a little quicker 
than normal. You don't have to put the redstone right away, but once you're all lined up and ready to go, then you can actually put down the redstone. So I'm just going to quick throw down some more pistons, just like this. And like so. I'm going to delete these guys. And then I'm going to do this, build this guy up, just like that. And then delete this one. And then do the same exact thing on the other side. And of course, you can build it up as or how as high as you guys really want it to go there's really no limit at all whatsoever so it's, it's always nice to know uh nice to know that but anyways I'll, I'll build it up one more level here and then we'll build this guy up another level and delete this now all you have to do is finish it off with the nice redstone it's really simple once you have the pistons already down look, look at this this pig's trying to climb this thing get off my redstone contraption thank you sir i appreciate your uh your kind kind response to that even though it kind of just shoved you off it looks like he's <laughs> is is the pig stuck in the redstone i think he is what's up dog oh, whatever uh, so now i just finish it off with the redstone on top as well as the other side and there we have it so now you're all ready to go Ah uh, man these mobs love this thing the mobs are the most annoying thing trying to make a tutorial i wish you could just turn off mobs uh whoops wrong way there we go, and this guy, followed by him and him, whoops, wrong way, hang on, there we go, and we have it, we are all ready to go, nice, 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 and of course, I'm not going to get fancy with it, you can always uh, put more blocks like here to cover this thing up, I don't know, do something neat like that, so I mean, and there, there we have it, there we go, I mean, some, something like that to kind of cover up the, the nice redstone stuff that we made, but for, honestly, for this tutorial, I, I figure like I don't want to waste your time, um, like making it look fancy or whatever. But anyways, obviously, if I just press this thing now, you can see it opens. You can go right through it if you guys really want to. But anyways, I hope you guys did enjoy today's video. If you guys did enjoy today's video, make sure you guys do smack the like button. And uh, next time you guys see a pig, make sure you guys give give him a redstone for me and say say it's from True Trees. Okay, okay, okay. Well, anyways, we'll catch you guys in the next video. Subscribe if you guys have not already, and uh, have a fantastic day. Stay true. Peace.